No! 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 Happy Valentine's Day. So I'm just off of class. I've only got one class today. Um, a lot of the theater kids are at a conference this week. So a lot of the teachers are gone too. So I don't have a ton of classes. I feel like I may have already told you that in one of these videos. Oh well, the point is um, I only have one class today and it's my makeup class. And we're gonna be talking about facial hair, like fake facial hair. I think applying facial hair today is only worth like 25 points. And the way the class works is that you have to get a thousand points to pass the class and there are a ton of projects and if you were to do every single project it would be the equivalent of like three thousand points so you just kind of get to pick and choose which projects you do so i mean 25 points is not a ton but i'll probably do it because my plan basically is to just well a do everything just as the rest of the class does it and just get the points and hopefully i can hit a thousand in the event that the twins decide they want to come in April, hopefully I'll have the thousand points and be able to be okay in the class if I have to miss for babies. Um, but also, I'm a vlogger now. And if there's a chance to do something interesting and weird for you, the people, I'm gonna do it. So I'm gonna give myself some facial hair today. Happy Valentine's Day from your bearded lady friends. Let's see how this goes. Be like, I'm like a makes you swagger a little bit too. Oh, right? well, I'm covering it. <laughs> I'm like right in front of my face. Look, so look at this beard like you can't film. see. <laughs> there we go. It's working. I have been singing to you for nine years. I was blitzing. I got here five minutes ago. Honey, I have to get that box before the end of tomorrow. You're right. I was singing my little heart out and you were just like, mm, swipe, swipe, swipe. But I saw you, I like your purple shirt. Thanks, I like your Valentine's outfit. Ooh, 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 LuLaRoe, LuLaRoe. Leggings. You ready to fix this uh, <sighs> mermaid tail? <laughs> I told Alicia I'm gonna start making voodoo dolls of all the actors. Oh yeah. Whenever they ruin a mermaid tail. Oh, I'm clocking in. Well, you, you better. better. You better get paid for this. this. So, I don't know who sings that song, but it's the one that's like, it's like a country song. And he goes, baby, I'm amazed by you. Yeah. Do you know who sings that? It came on and I changed the station. <laughs> Rude. So, that song came on and I pulled up next to Liesl and I started yelling at her. There's an accident, so I'm stuck. Liesl's over there getting gas and I just cat called her. <laughs> it was the best. Happy Valentine's Day, everyone. I volunteer to be in charge of dinner tonight. We usually choose to stay in rather than go out because, well, it's gonna be crazy out in the world and it's cheaper to just stay home. So you can watch me cook. You love it when I teach you how to cook, don't you? Because I'm such a culinary genius. So today I'm going to be making a mozzarella and pepper and spinach stuffed chicken. Uh, with some beans, string beans, and mashed potatoes on the side, so nothing super fancy. But let's start with the chicken. First thing we need to do is preheat our oven to 400 degrees. I have two chicken breasts that have been marinating in Italian salad dressing all day. Um, so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna pull those out and we're gonna cut them, we're gonna butterfly them. So we just slice them open like this and now we're gonna put some Italian seasoning and some salt and some pepper over them. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna sprinkle some cheese on both, onto the chicken breast. We're gonna do a little bit of grated Parmesan. And then even more mozzarella. Bear in mind you're gonna fold these back in half so you don't really have to evenly coat the side that's going to be on top. We'll add some cheese for that to stick. Now we're 
we're just gonna lay some spinach leaves onto the chicken. We interrupt Liesl's cooking show so that I can talk to you while I drive. <laughs> so Liesl has stolen the camera, so I'm using my phone, but I have a surprise. She thinks it's like some big present. I've already gotten her present. This is a surprise for dinner, so I have to run to Walmart to get it. It's not that great. I'm just getting stuff for like a fancy beverage, so come with me. Now we're gonna chop up some red peppers. Be sure to rinse your cutting board because it had raw meat on it. So now we're gonna lay those peppers onto our chicken. Then we're gonna add some more spinach. Just a light layer over the top of those. And then you're just gonna press that down and fold that chicken breast over the top of your vegetables. And then once your oven is preheated, you're just gonna stick those inside and you're gonna bake these for about 40 to 50 minutes or until the chicken is done. Hey, hot stuff. Hey. Hey. <laughs> what you cooking? I'm just finishing up the chicken. Great. So I went to the store, as they all know, because I said Liesl commandeered the camera, so I have to use my phone. Oh, I wasn't using it, you could have taken it. Oh, I could have taken you along with me. It's okay, because you come along with me on my phone. Either way, I bought stuff to drink. Again, Walmart, the entire city of Springville was in there. Why are we shopping on the, the Valentine's Day? No one knows. Anyway, I bought stuff to make this fruity raspberry drink. It's got whole raspberries in there. This Simply Tropical Punch because I couldn't find pineapple juice. It's got Sprite. Pineapple it's got juice. this pineapple lemonade. Juice is in cans. In the canned oh, aisle. Oh, pineapple juice is in the canned aisle. I didn't know, but this should be good because it's got like mango pineapple in it. Sounds delicious. I got stuff to make chocolate covered strawberries because Valentine's Day. Necessity. Everyone. Because Valentine's Day. Remember the picture of last year? <laughs> that ooh that you got? I'll yes. put it in here in this video so you can see last year when I made chocolate covered strawberries. I was so good at it and my face was just like, ooh. He did it for cliche Valentine's last year. Oh, that's right. That's cliche Valentine's. But today it's real Valentine's. And then we're gonna put a scoop of raspberry sorbet in this little fruity drink. Delicious, right? I think so. There's almost ready. Mm -hmm. Then it will be time for presents. I love presents. Hey babe. Hi baby. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. It's time for presents. I, yours are so big, mine is so little. Listen, yours is wrapped in Christmas paper. I can see that. So don't feel bad. It only says let it snow, that's just technically winter paper. It's winter paper and it's red and white. So, I mean, technically it's still winter. Yeah. Okay, it's present time. Do you want to go first or should I? I don't know, it's up to you. I'll go first, to give you mine. Oh. Okay. Mine comes in two parts. You can open part one first. Yay! <laughs> Look. Cupcake liners. Cupcake liners. So we don't use Barbie ones. Not Barbie ever. ones. Thanks, babe. You're welcome. Ready. Okay, now here's your big one. Don't light the paper on fire. Wrapped in Christmas paper with Packing tape. Packing tape. Oh! This is amazing. <laughs> it makes 24 cupcakes in one bean. Yeah. <gasps> I didn't even know these existed. There they are. <laughs> this is so great. Happy Valentine's. Thanks, baby. You're welcome. Okay. Happy Valentine's. I don't know Why anything that it, it could be. <laughs> I don't know anything that it could be. You're so clever. Ooh, a new wallet. 
I needed one. I know, and I hit the jackpot, babe. Yeah? Because leather wallets can be kind of expensive, mm, right? Yeah. But I went to Macy's randomly that day I decided to go shopping, yeah. and I was like, I'll just go see how much like good leather wallets normally cost, so I kind of have an idea of like, what I'm looking at. Yeah. And they were having a sale, and so I got it for in budget. Nice. Even though it normally isn't. <laughs> <sighs> Well, I was in budget too, mind you. We did it! <laughs> Derek never stays in budget. I like gift giving. He does. Okay! Happy Valentine's. Happy Valentine's. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Derek's making chocolate covered strawberries. Ooh, I'm not supposed to linger because he just says they don't look very good. This chocolate is getting too cold. I don't want to talk about the movie last night because <laughs> we didn't. <laughs> So we watched Me Before You, right? It was our cliche Valentine's chick flick romance movie. Uh -huh. And it was very cliche Valentine chick flicky. I mean, like, it Grumpy's was a chick boy. Flick. Boy hates girl. Boy has issues. Girl tries to love boy. Girl has boyfriend who gets jealous. Boy and girl fall in love. There's a really dramatic first kiss. You're so rooting for this couple to be together. You want them to be together so bad because he hates life, right? And you're like, she's giving him a purpose to live. Because he's a quadriplegic, for those of you who don't know. And it, I mean, they had good things going. It was, it was going well for everyone. And then the ending. And then the ending. We're not gonna ruin it for you. This is how I feel about the ending. Are you ready? No! 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 That's how I feel. I've been thinking about it all day because I'm still mad. I cried. I cried tears of anger. Not, I did not cry tears of sadness. I did not cry tears of happiness. I did not cry because it was beautiful. I cried because I was so mad about how it ended. <laughs> so if you haven't seen it, I don't know whether or not to tell you to see it. I mean, it had its moments. I don't know. I would probably watch it again, but just know, I really hated the ending. There were better ways to handle that. Oh well. But what can you do? If you have seen it, the little one just took the vent off. How the vent did that happen? Off, and I don't know how he did it, but it scared him and he ran away. But if you have seen me before you, how did you feel about the ending? Like, can you get behind that? Because I just, I can't get behind it. What did you think? Let us know. Happy Valentine's. Thanks, babe. You're so welcome. Excited. That cat stole my spot again. Or did you steal his spot? Uh, no, I was there first. <laughs> Rude. I mean, no one's mad that we've demolished this plate of strawberries. No one's mad, right? It will be gone in the next two seconds. Yeah. So, like, I'm gonna eat them. Yeah. So it's time to say goodnight. It's time to say goodnight. Should we make a theme song? <laughs> Every time that we play it's at the end. Time. Nope. It's too much work. <laughs> it's a lot of work. <laughs> to make a jingle. And we're not the most like musically inclined when it comes to like composing music. I can't write music. <laughs> I'll sing it for you any day. I can't write it. No. Um Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Mm. Love you. Love you. I hope you had a good Valentine's Day. And if you didn't have a good Valentine's Day, pff, this day's the worst. <laughs> I hate this day. Yeah, it's not even that good. This day's <laughs> the stupidest. So, maybe you had a Galentine's Day today. No one knows. Galentine's is great, too. Yeah, Galentine's I used to are do fun. that. Next year, Cliché Valentine's Day is the way to go. So be sure you do Cliché Valentine's Day and then have some romance on the actual day. Great. Anything else? I don't think so. Okay. We'll do it again tomorrow. Have courage and be kind. Uh, speaking of have courage and be kind, I want you to always have courage and be kind. Because sometimes you don't know someone's situation and you don't know what they're going through and you just have to be that person. That's true. That brightens up their day. And sometimes it can be a stranger. The other day, yeah. I was walking to class in my pregnant belly in my dress and this girl walked past me. I have no idea who she was, like never seen her in my life. And like, just as she walked past me, she was like, your dress is really cute. And I was like, thanks. <laughs> 
And Thank you. It, it felt nice. And I was like, I wish that I was better at telling, like, when I see someone and I'm like, oh, that's cute. I should say something, even if I don't know them, because yeah. it makes them feel good. Makes them feel good. Have courage and be kind. Be an advocate for having courage and being kind. Brighten up someone's day. Like, be known as that person who's just, like, always nice. Yeah, because that's what this world needs. What's that quote that's like, be the kind of person that if someone had something bad to say about you, no one would believe it. That's the first time I've heard that, but that's great. I may have paraphrased a little. <laughs> that's okay. That is okay. So, have courage and be kind. Don't spread drama. Don't spread the drama. It makes it worse. It makes life worse for others. It makes your life kind of bitter as well. So don't spread drama. Have courage and be kind. And we will see you tomorrow. Bye! Bye!